Hey everyone, and welcome to the introduction to the Azure Masterclass. And this is actually something I used to do online once a year over the period of a month. And I've now decided to kind of just create this playlist on YouTube, so it's available to everyone for free. Now you may be wondering why am I standing in front of the screen to do this class? And essentially for the format of this, I was gonna do it originally as kind of PowerPoint and demos, just voiceover. And I kind of asked online, I posted something on LinkedIn, because some people have kind of said, hey look, we like the plural site content you do, but we prefer the whiteboard videos. So I kind of asked people, look, how should I do the masterclass? Should it be PowerPoint only? Um, some PowerPoint with me whiteboarding and then all whiteboard. And basically the consensus was, hey, um, do the whiteboard with some PowerPoint. So this is why it's in this format. Um, you chose this. So my goal is, let me skip past, from the agenda, I really want to kind of take the complete gambit, the complete view of Azure. I want to do comments for our interaction. So if you go and ask a question in the comments, I'm going to keep an eye on that and I'll try and answer anything you kind of post in there. And I'm going to take this, try and build. So the goal is you, you come from nothing and I'm going to try and introduce the concepts in the logical way that build on the previous one. So I'll put these in a playlist. I'm also going to have other videos I've created that I'll probably link to in some way. I'll have a GitHub repository. I'm going to experiment with this. So there'll be like optional side videos to watch as well. So obviously this is just an intro video. The first main module will be kind of cloud Microsoft Azure 101. Then we'll build into identity and governance. Then we'll go ahead and look at what are the various options and costs and optimizations I should be considering as I build out my cloud. We'll look at storage and database services, virtual networks, connectivity to on-premises, and then we'll actually look at compute services. So virtual machines, virtual machine scale sets, containers, AKS, the other types of compute service, load balancing, enabling external connectivity, high availability, disaster recovery, migration to Azure, secrets and keys. How do I maintain these important bits of information in Azure that I don't want to put in plain text somewhere? Monitoring security, and then infrastructure as code, DevOps, and then just other key Azure technologies I think are useful. So my goal is over the next couple of months, I'll post at least one video a week. So make sure you subscribe and hit the little bell icon. It'll notify you when I post a new video. So over the next couple of months, I should get all of these created and then I'll update them as need be. So my goal is soup to nuts. This is kind of based on the old um, dinners. You start off with soup and at the end of the meal, you'd have nuts. So I'm going to try and cover the complete kind of gambit of Azure. I'm going to build it in a logical way, building on the previous module. Now, technology does change. I will update the modules as need be. I might remove things, I might add new ones in. I will reference, as I mentioned, other videos I've created, deeper dives. Like I've got an 80 minute express route deep dive. I'm not gonna go into that amount of detail in this course. I'll cover the basics and then kind of link off if you wanna go into even more detail. So again, make sure you do that subscribe so you find out when I'm posting these things. I'm gonna create a playlist so on my YouTube channel, I'll actually create a playlist. So I'll link to it in the comments of this. So there'll be a playlist for this masterclass and that will kind of have the videos in the right order. Also on my YouTube channel, I've got things like my weekly infrastructure updates, staying up to date is super important and sort of various types of deep dive on there as well. And again, I'll have a GitHub repo for code. So if I'm doing a demo and you see me using a script or a template, I'll put it in the GitHub repo for this course. So I'm gonna cover things, things change. So I really do recommend every Sunday I record a video. It's normally no more than 15 minutes and it goes through all of the things that have changed over the previous week. 
So that covers things like Azure Compute, Storage, Networking, Identity, Governance. Um, this Sunday, I just recorded something on the new Azure Bicep, um, the new declarative kind of domain specific language that I can use instead of having to directly create JSON files. So I'm going to cover those things. So staying up to date is really critical to be successful. So I would go and check out that weekly update. Now, people always ask, um, what certification is this for? This is not focused on any specific certification. Um, my goal of this is to give knowledge about Azure that you can use in a useful way. So that's the focus. That being said, the content I'm going to cover would help with certainly the Azure Fundamentals and the Azure Administrator Associate Certification. That would also help with some of the architect things, but the content I'm going to cover would kind of definitely cover those two. Now, if you just want to do the Azure Fundamentals, I have like an AZ900, I have a DP900, I have an MS900 whiteboard study overview video. They're like an hour and a quarter each. That's going to be the most useful thing if all you want to do is get like Azure Fundamentals. But I'm going to kind of cover that sort of type of information. So this is the introduction. Again, questions, ask in the comments, make sure you subscribe, and now let's get on with the actual content.